Hey, my name is Matias and this is Eric. We're in Millen Colin. And you guys are watching Ambi. Boom. Hey everyone, it's Alicia from Ambi and I would like to welcome you to our interview with Millen Colin. Hello. Hey, how are hey, you? How's it going? How are you both doing? Good, Great. good. You're kicking off this North American tour in Toronto tonight. This is the first show, so how are you feeling about everything that's to come? There are many sold out shows on this tour. Yeah, we we're psyched. This is actually the first time we're going from like east to west in Canada for many years. We've yeah. done it before, but like kind of missed the mid parts of Canada. So yeah, we're excited. Excited, Ready to be yeah. Back, yeah. I was checking out your merch and you have some really beautiful blue vinyl with the chicks on it. You have a bunch of different shirt creations and skateboard decks, which is very cool. I figured you guys would have skateboard decks. <laughs> yeah, yeah, of course. Yeah. Of course. <laughs> <laughs> What's your favorite piece of Mill and Colin merch? Do you have one? Wow, uh, I made all the merch. It's hard for me to say. I so I'm asking the have right guy. A, have a uh, it must be the skateboards. Okay. Since we, we love skateboards. Yeah, yeah, the skateboards yeah. are actually really good. We skate them ourselves. I mean, they're. Yeah. They, it's not like just decks, like you know? a, like you do a skateboard as a band. Like we did the shape and everything. So they're like what we like, like yeah. in size wise and concave and stuff. So mm -hmm. they're actually really good boards. I knew going into this that you guys love skateboarding. Of course, the name came from a skateboard trick. So you have to tell me about some of your best wipeouts. Oh, wipeouts. I broke my ankle, my wrist. Your wrist. Yeah. Yeah. That was a long time ago, but uh, it was pretty gnarly. They had to uh, sedate me to. Get it right again. Yeah, and yeah. I broke my ankle, oh, no. <laughs> and and I still have I have to like fix it before I go like really skate. Otherwise, mm. I will because it's like all loose. I even do it on, on stage these days because it's so easy. My I don't know it's all fucked up. It's like there's no fucking stability in it oh. anymore. Our drummer but broke his collarbone in Australia when we we're on tour, and uh, we were actually going to Japan afterwards. So we had to get a new drummer. <laughs> we had a big show. Like we had one day off. Yeah. Where that guy had to learn all the songs and he traveled us to Japan too. Yeah, that, it was quite, quite a mess. Yeah, after but, that, like... Uh, but he, he's, he's banned, he can't skateboard anymore. No, and, and, and the record company and the, and the booking agents was like, you guys shouldn't bring boards on the road anymore. <laughs> and like, but uh, we still do it. I got my board in the in the bus. No, I really enjoyed the videos you post on Instagram, even when you guys are kind of just goofing off and doing yeah. tricks. Like, I love yeah. the insight, so uh, yeah. awesome. Yeah, to it was fun to, to shoot. I haven't filmed any skateboarding in a long, long time. And we did like a morning session in our park and we just brought a camera and filmed some ollies, nothing yeah. fancy. No. <laughs> Regular stuff, you know. Well, on the music front, True Brew has been out for a year now. Congrats on its release. Thanks. Yeah, You're thanks. welcome. Thanks. My favorite track off the record would have to be Perfection is Boring. I oh, just cool. feel like every kid or you know teenager should hear that song because the messaging is just amazing. Even when I hear it, I feel like you really shouldn't be as hard on yourself as you are. And the line, the cracks and the scars is what make things unique is great. So what sparked the idea for that track? I guess it's, uh, yeah, it's Nicola who wrote the lyrics and uh, I guess it's his, uh, yeah, I, I don't know actually where it, where it came from, that, that yeah. idea, but I, I just, he, he writes about stuff that he's thinking of. Yeah, know. and then we totally agree. Yeah, uh, yeah. Like perfection is is boring. I mean, yeah. it's yeah, like like what you just said. Yeah. So yeah, I, I think he. That is a good he, message. Yeah, definitely. He got a good message right there. Yeah. Well, for me, I couldn't help but notice the animal theme that you carry throughout <laughs> your records. I don't know if some people have noticed, but for life on a play has the little chick. For the monkeys, of course, has the monkeys. There are deer antlers in Kingwood, and then the bear on the uh, True Brew cover. So. Is this intentional for you guys? Or we you just love animals. Okay, it's just so like, it like it's a I, I, decision. Nah, yeah. I'm, okay. do, I'm doing all the artwork for for the band, and it's just like animals are. I mean, the, the, it, it's good to have like an object or something different, and an animal is always like you can relate to a lot of stuff. And and the, the polar bear on the new one is like we always joke, especially when you're in like warmer countries they think that actually polar bears are running around the streets of sweden and we tell them that they do so the polar bear has been like uh <laughs> some kind of but a millenclone animal it's okay. also funny thing with the bear and beer in sweden mm -hmm. people sometimes pronounce bear as beer okay. polar beer because they don't really get it so you, you can make funny jokes about yeah. this yeah. yeah we actually yeah, we, we did a thing uh <laughs> A skateboard deck with a with a beer bottle and it said polar uh, beer instead of and then we had the bear. Uh, uh, it, it's, it's so it's, funny. It's, it's, it's so funny. Super funny. Yeah, we were comedians. We're all very the way funny guys. <laughs>
Well, the album was recorded in your own recording studio, SoundLab yep. Studios. So mm -hmm. could you kind of take us into the studio? What does it look like? Do you have anything cool hanging up? Just tell us the vibe of the place. It's a very cool place. I actually built it uh, back in the year 2000 with my friend. So it's a nice uh, place and we have a very nice Hawaii, uh, what do you call it? Wallpaper. Wallpaper. So it feels like you're in on the beach when you're sitting <laughs> there. It's very, um, no, it's just a, a cool place. Yeah, but, but yeah. from January it's gone. Yeah, we're gonna. We need to move because they're rebuilding the yeah. the building. Oh, okay. But it's nice to have your own studio, and you know we could take our time to record it. You know, the album, and uh, yeah, it's good. It's also kind of scary to do it in your own place because uh, you're the supervisor of the whole thing. Yeah. So you know you have to trust yourself and that it's gonna be great. <laughs> yeah, yeah, <laughs> but, but we actually we we know what we want to sound like after yeah. these years. So I mean, it was but great. It, it, great that Matthias produced it. I think. Yeah. No it, one could have done it better no, really it's hard with the you have to draw a limit when it's when it's done yeah otherwise yeah. you can sit there for 10 years wow you know we're gonna have to find some more hawaiian wallpaper for the new yeah 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 yeah. We'll, yeah 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 we got yeah. one already maybe, maybe yeah. we'll do some snow theme no 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 In siberia <laughs> no, siberia no. <laughs> no no i like i like the beach better yeah. <laughs> a polar bear maybe yeah <laughs> yeah uh, siberia be with polar bears cool. yeah, no, a beer bear a bear <laughs> bears yeah, yeah. Well, I just want to do a, a little quick fire round with the two of you. Yep. So I'm just going to ask a question. Whatever comes to mind, just go ahead All right. and say it. So the first one being, what's a movie that you can watch over and over? Big Lebowski. Uh, yeah. <laughs> 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 Who's the coolest celebrity or band that you've met? The, what? The coolest celebrity or band that you've met. Uh, um, I, I met uh, Greg Daly from the African Wigs. Um, oh, cool. Uh, that's a good band. So no, I must say, Steve Caballero, uh, old the skater. Yeah. Uh, I mean, he he's a great friend of ours and and uh, mm -hmm. big Milan Colin fan too. And he been playing bass with us uh, at, at a lot of shows yeah, and stuff. He's, so he's a great dude. It's it's awesome. If I knew that I would be friends with Steve Caballero when I started skating when I was ten years old, I would freak. You know. So it's really cool to oh, yeah. call him a friend. Yeah. Steve Caballero. Shout out. <laughs> <laughs> and who would your dream jam session be with? Uh, musically? Mm -hmm. uh, Eric Olson. <laughs> <laughs> right back at you. Yeah. <laughs> Easy. <laughs> and what's a must have on your tour rider? Uh, yes. it must be beer. Yeah, beer is yeah. important. Beer, bear. Yeah. Bear, 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 or bear. bear that's, a, that's the thing. When you walk into the dressing room, you never know if it's a, a beer or a yeah, bear. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah if they read it, you know. It keeps yeah. on your toes. Especially yeah, exactly. in Sweden. I'll especially drink. in Sweden. If, if the if the writer is in English, you know, you never know. It could be a bear in there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because yeah, they <laughs> yeah. think the beer is the bear. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, right. <laughs> My point. Yeah, yeah, yeah I know. Well, just to wrap things up today, is there anything you want to say to all of your fans who will be viewing? Now we're just happy to be here, and uh, hopefully uh, you guys will come to the show. We're yeah, going to have a blast. Love touring. It's yeah. great to be here. Love Toronto. Yeah, we love it all. <laughs> <laughs> and Toronto loves you. Thank you so much for Thank chatting. You. Thank you. It's my pleasure. And remember, Thanks. to everybody viewing, you can visit us at amusicblogia.com for all exclusive interviews, features, videos, and so much more with your favorite bands. See you next time. Cheers. Bye-bye.